I think it's it's boosted my like public talking a lot and my leadership skills, lead sessions when it comes to sports that I do. And it also has improved like my self-esteem, my body image, and just the way I think about me and basically others. Definitely the opportunities that I've got to do. So um, them helping part of the residential, the trips that I go on, the the whole basically sessions that they run every week. It, um, it gives me something to do and something to look forward to. I've seen Erin become more resilient. She's more confident in herself. She's more confident in her ability to take part in sports and she's more confident in her future. Erin is motivated, more motivated than before. She has shown that she's capable and she's proven to herself and other people that she is a leader. Um, so I've done the Sweaty Betty programme and I'm currently on the Active to Grow programme. The Sweaty Betty one, so what we did is we came every Wednesday up to St R and we would basically talk about fitness and we would go for, to the gym for an hour to like boost our confidence and basically just having that little extra bit of fitness uh, was a safe place for us to talk about stuff that we couldn't really talk about outside of the programme. Erin is very deserving of the Unsung Hero Award. Um, she is a phenomenal young person who's both developed in herself and developed other young people. Um, it's incredible watching her grow over the past year and I can't wait to see what the future holds for Erin. It's definitely worth your time and it's definitely worth being able to say that you've done it and definitely something that's enjoyable and something that's fun, somewhere you can talk to people and make new friends.